how long has it been since you've seen your family? Ooh, um, close to 10 years. 10 years. Yeah. What's been the hesitancy? Because I've me messed up so many times before. You know, they've heard me say sorry a thousand times. I'm originally from Korea. My family and I moved here when I was six years old. In my culture, the family name means a lot. There's expectations attached to it. I brought a lot of shame to my family because I didn't uphold those expectations. I had a heroin addiction for over 20 years. The consequences are tremendous. I ended up alone on the street and I lost my family. Well, uh, Father God, thank you for waking us up this morning, cleaning us over in our right minds. Thank you for this food we're about to eat. Bless the hands of prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I live here at the Union Rescue Mission, a place to recover your soul and transform your life. I've been here for the past year and a half. Having to trust in God was really tough. I came to the realization of having to surrender. That's what he intended for me. Because of my pride and wanted to be in control, he had to humble me. You only feel his grace and his love for you when you surrender to him. This mission, this ministry, exists to advance the kingdom of God. We want to follow the master. We want to be a part of the kingdom. Forgiveness is a part of the redemption. Restoration is a part of the process. That's why we're here. Forgiveness is a word to me that was foreign in the sense that I had asked for forgiveness numerous times from my family, but in all reality, I wasn't able to forgive myself for what I've done. Jesus is saying, if you're gonna be in the kingdom, you need to come to terms with the work of forgiveness in your own heart. Don't do any of this alone. Talk to somebody. Talk to somebody. I'm realizing that community is necessary. We have to be in relationships. We have to answer the hard questions. That's how we grow. So your brother, sent you a friend request on Facebook. Why has that been sitting in your inbox for a month and you haven't responded? And I put off contact and or trying to reconnect with my family because I was, I always felt like I needed to bring something to the table, you know, but I'm not held by those expectations anymore. Why are you ready now? What's different about today? I feel like, you know, his friend request is telling me they're ready to forgive, or I say they. Um, he symbolizes my family right now. And you're ready. I'm ready to make it happen, <laughs> or let it happen. Amen. Amen. This is it. I can't believe everybody's so grown up now. Oh, wow, there's my dad. That's my dad. Since you've seen a picture of your dad? Oh, ten years. You don't have a picture of him? You don't keep pictures of your family? No, I lost everything that, um... Mm. And it was easier to deal with, not having any, uh, reminders, you know. I wasted a lot of time. Too long. I would like to make amends with all of them, you know, if possible. But with God, I feel like everything's
it's gonna be okay, no matter what. This whole past year and a half is like a whole new life. God has slowly been restoring me. I relied on heroin to be the answer to everything. Now, I leave it to God. I'm just a lost child that now has come to realize I'm trusting God. That's it.